Hello, fellow Photoshop enthusiasts. My name is Sylvia Vale, and I will show you a quick trick how to make freckles pop. So in order to isolate the freckles from the rest of the skin, we need to go into our channels and select the layer where they pop the most, which is going to be the blue channel. In order to select the difference in this layer, you go on command click and that should select everything. And then you go back into your layers and select the channel mixer because this is perfect for getting those freckles really emphasized and beautifully standing out. Excellent. So that loaded our layer mask as well. As you can see, this is our blue layer. And what you want to do is you have to invert this because right now the freckles are darker which basically deletes them from anything that we make on the progress of the channel mixer. So you go command I to invert the layer and this will make the freckles pop. You want to set the layer onto soft light because that creates a much better result than if you were to put it on anything else, especially normal that's gonna really mess with your output and select monochrome here in the properties. There's a simple formula that you can keep in mind when you do this and it's basically the red channel you put on about minus 30. You can variate that of course. The green channel on plus 50 and the blue channel on plus 50. So that's gonna definitely get those freckles popping. And now we can check that. They are definitely darker, but unfortunately everything else that was in the same shade or in that blue channel um, was made darker as well, especially the shadows. So we will have to go into our layer mask and erase anything that you do not want in there. I sometimes like to work in the mask view, so just hit alt click for that. And then go over all the white spots with the black brush, because those are the spots that are too dark right now. It doesn't have to be precise sometimes, especially in hair, it's not that big of a deal to leave that in. You can even select multiple freckles in this process with a white brush, a very, very soft white brush, and make them even whiter so they stand out even more. And then you can always go back to your original and see what you're doing, actually. Perfect. That is so much better. And then over here, for this part, because this is still very, very dark, just lower your flow. Keep it at 100% opacity, but lower your flow to about 1%. And then just go back and forth with your brush. It's very helpful to have a tablet in this case. And just do that, and that will get the job done nicely. Perfect. Looking nice. I love it. Of course, if you want to emphasize it even more, you can just go on Command J, duplicate that, and it's gonna give you an even harsher selection. But I would like to tone that down to about here. Perfect. That definitely made her freckles pop even more, as you can see. Here's before, after, before, after. And I like the, the look of just that one layer. That's enough. Nice. Well, thank you so much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know if you have any suggestions, questions, and let me know if you want me to make any specific tutorials. See you next time.